What is up guys, it's Kilbrick here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to put fonts in Pixlr. Um, it's pretty easy to do, let me load up Pixlr real quick. Um, yeah. I'm actually uploading a whole 45 minute video of me pretty much talking for like soft, free software, so if you guys want to go check out that video, because it has this in it too, but I figured I'll just go more of like an explosion, or I figured I'll go more in depth than this. Um, because I feel like in the video, so I, had, I had a rush to it, kind of. But if I actually talked in my normal speed and actually went through everything, it would take about two hours. But I decided to go quickly for it to have one video because I don't want 10 spread out videos. But honestly, I think that I made a mistake. I should have just done every single video right away. But okay, I got this thing loaded up. I'll just show you guys in a second. Um, Alright, so what you guys want to do, you want to have the like, define open. So this is what you guys have. Uh, I want to make sure I'm actually recording. Yeah, I am. Um, but this is a quick and easy video. I'm not going to make it long at all. So you want to upload dot or the font. So I'm gonna download a random one. So I'll do um, I'll just do uh, I'll just do schools out. Why not? Cause school is out. All right. We're gonna save it. All right, it has downloaded completely. So what you guys want to do now? You guys want to go to a control panel. If you have a PC or Windows, I believe you can do that. You go to appearance and personalization. You go to fonts. All right. So now you guys got here, you open up your files and go to um, downloads. Now I forgot which one it was. Wasn't it schools out? Yeah, I think it was. Let's look for it. So this is all in alphabetical order, this should be in uh, S. Okay, schools out zip. So what you guys gotta do here, I'm gonna shrink it down a little bit. So if you try putting the fonts in right now, it wouldn't go in because what you have to do, it's not installed yet. You have to actually click on it, double click on it with your left trigger. And then install it. And once it's done installing, okay, it's done installing. Now you can actually put it in there. So now you'll have schools out in there. It won't show up in there right away. Here, let's see where it is. Is schools out in there yet? Actually, schools out. Yeah, look at that. It's right there in there. Or that's how you add it in there. But once you go back to the Pixlr, um, just pull out your keyboard. Um, I got that. All right. So let's go. To, I'm I'm a little bold for it, but let's look for schools out. That's the one we just downloaded. School's out right here. So let's do. I'm gonna do my username for YouTube. Hill Freak 2001. We're gonna actually put the size to about. I'll do 130. Why not? So I get bigger and show you guys. Look at that. That's how you guys add fonts into. Uh, Pixlr, which it's a pretty easy thing to do. I have like the GTA file in here, which is uh, the price down black or it's price down. Let's look for it. You see, price down is right here, and then I added one for a different for like the other thing I did. But that's fine. But that's how you guys do it. That's how you guys add fonts into Pixlr. I probably do more videos today on just how to add fonts or just do anything inside of uh, Pixlr or other type of software you can use for like free up uh, or like software you can use to do stuff. That sounded really bad. I'll rephrase that. I'll download or I'll show you guys more videos of me just showing you guys free softwares, how to like upload videos and make better production for a YouTube channel. So anyways guys, thank you guys for watching the video and stay awesome. Goodbye everyone.